hey guys welcome back to a new vlog seems like this is kind of like my favorite spot to start the vlogs now it's either here or on that side but i just wanted to start the vlog and say hey hope you guys are doing well if you're a new subscriber please don't forget to hit the subscribe button down below and join the family and if you are a returning subscriber welcome and thank you for tuning in um so today is currently saturday and um we're just planning to go out on a lunch we're meant to have left at 12 it's almost uh, 12 30 I'm ready so I'm just waiting for them to pick me up um, so I just wanted to show you guys a quick outfit of the day so this is the outfit for today I've got on this H&M dress I don't iron it because I didn't want it to be like wide I wanted it to be a little bit tight fitting um, so I just paired it up with the white top on top and obviously my um, Air Force ones have become like my favorite pair of sneakers and then I just curled up my hair and yeah that was so this just reminded me I actually purchased a new pair of shoes um, running shoes but they were quite a little bit small so I got a size 5 I'm gonna change them for a five and a half I wanted a white pair it's been like a struggle to try find a white um, Nike shoe so I found these Adidas of Superbulous and yeah I can't wait for the correct size to be delivered so I can wear these to the gym um, and yeah and then I'm gonna try find another pair of Nike sneakers so that's just an update of what I purchased this week um, yeah so I'm just gonna I'm just gonna wait for them to come pick me up I guess I guess I'm just gonna play the waiting game now Alone. Say hi, Chai Mi. Chai Mi. Say hi. Hey, Chai Mi. Hey, Chai Mi. Hi. 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 Uh, like, we're like regulars in your vlog now. Yeah. <laughs> Say hi to mom and dad. Say hi, mommy. Say hi, mom and dad. <laughs> <laughs> hey guys, welcome back. So actually, this vlog started, but I ended up not vlogging much. <laughs> hi. Hi. Um, what was I about to say? So today is Saturday once again. This vlog started last week Saturday. I thought I was going to vlog throughout the week, but I did not. <laughs> but I did not. So I'm just coming up here to say hey guys, but I'm not going to be taking you guys with me because we're going to a party. Um, and yeah, we don't want that stress of like having to vlog and having to have like the camera and stuff like that We just want to have a great time so Just want to come on here and say hi and show you guys our outfits. So we're wearing all black. So Tandy, what are you wearing? Oh, guys, you know, you always have to have this little black number in your closet what? Literally had this black number for years years. I mean like years I always pull her out when I just want to like, you know, show the people like the twins Okay, and I'm wearing a stolen dress as all always. I'm always always wearing stolen items. Do you want to show them for me, please? Yes. Because the Missy didn't hear the memo. Yeah. You always have to have a black number. So I don't time. have a black number, guys. So this is what I'm wearing. Who would have thought I would be able to fit into Tiny's dresses? But I'm wearing this dress is from Shop Bread Robson, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, and then it's got this feather slit on the side, and this is what it looks like at the back. And then I just have like the pony. And my hair gelled back. So yeah. Cute. Thank you. Thank you guys. So for the week, Tanya and I have decided to go vegan. And we are having meals from 
my sweet potato. So the meal for today is pepper pasta with zucchini. And then I will film a what I eat in a week for you guys. So you'll get to see the other meals. So there's two more meals in there. And then they'll deliver two more mm -hmm. on Wednesday. 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 Yeah. So I'm going to try this out and let you guys know. Hey guys, welcome back. So I've been receiving a lot of comments. People asking me to do my makeup, everyday makeup look. So I just thought I'd come do it quickly on here with you guys. Uh, it's not really anything special, but I'll do it with you guys. So I've been using this um, Benefit Brow Styler for my eyebrows is what it looks like. And this is in the shade, I don't know, shade five, shade five. There we go over there, shade five. I don't know why I looked at that. And I didn't think that would be the shade. So at times I will usually set my brows with my um, got to be glued styling gel for edges. Just so that they stay in place. Because I've got kind of like stubborn brows. So I don't put like a lot. So I'll just like brush them up. like so this side's really good but this side not that perfect and then i'll just remove like the excess at the bottom and the top and wait for that to dry for a bit now that they dry just gonna fill them in I don't really fill in way too much so just like that is more than enough and then I will go in with this flat brush I got from this came it's from the color brand and then I will go in with my L'Oreal um, more than concealer and the shade 338 or honey When that is done, I will go in with my NARS foundation. As you guys can see, it's almost done. And I am in the shade. I forgot now. I will check my shade and let you guys know. But I'll go in with this. So I just squeeze it onto. Oopsie, I actually forgot. my primer I'm just gonna try put on the other areas that I didn't I'll go in with like a normal foundation brush I think I got this from Avon and it needs a wash but we need it right now So when I'm going on with my foundation, I'm tapping it in and then swiping it all over my face. So I like tap it in all over, go all the way to my ears. Same with my forehead. And then still go over my edges with the foundation just so that we don't have like that line. As soon as that is done, I go in with my contour, um, so I cream contour, and I use this black opal foundation stick in the color suede mocha. So just go in like that. 
on my nose and just a little bit on my forehead so just maybe add a little more because I'm lazy I use the same brush starting off with my nose You may not see it, but it does make a difference when the look is done. I don't like it to be too harsh. I still like it to look natural. That's why I don't go in with a very dark shade, but this does make a difference. When that's done, I will go in with the same uh, L'Oreal uh, concealer, but this time in the color Toffee 336. That's what it looks like, 336. And I will use this to highlight. And then I will go in with a damp beauty blender. I often see people using like a dry beauty blender, but that doesn't work for me. So I usually wash it every time before I use it. It's damp and I will just um, blend that in. When going in as well, I then just use that excess concealer and put it onto my eyelid. When that's done, just to make it more seamless, I'll go back with the foundation brush and just blend that in so there aren't any harsh lines. And that way, it sort of just, you know, blends in. So in setting, I use two setting powders. So I start off with the Yardley Translucent powder in the shade translucent bear and this is the pinkish one not the white one and then i'll just go in that's done I will then go in with the NYX can't stop won't stop setting powder in the shade banana When that's done, I will then set my contour with NYX as well. So I use this uh, Can't Stop Bone Stop powder foundation in the color ma Mahogany. Yeah. And I take just as little as possible with that type of brush. And I just do that. So just tap it in. And that's about it for that. When it comes to eyeshadow, I usually use one eyeshadow because I'm that lazy. So I will either go in with the uh, Juvia's Place, is it Juicy Juvia's Place or something? The Zulu palette, or I will go in with my Anastasia Beverly Hills Times Jackie Ina palette. And I will show you guys that I literally go for the same shade. And you guys can guess which shade. I go for because everything else still hasn't been touched I'm very afraid of color but maybe I should actually try something different today I feel like having a shimmer on so I think I'm gonna go for edges and this one here let's see how that goes 
So I literally use this type of brush here, just tap it in. So the trick to get your eyeshadow to be pigmented is to literally just dab it in one area at a time and not like sweep it through. I learned that from my sister. I'll then go in with this type of brush here to then put in the wigglies. Now that that is done, I will go in with my top mascara, just the top. Dust off the excess powder. Don't worry too much about it not looking like it's set in place. We will spray it. Um, and then I will go in with some blush. So what I use as blush, I'm not sure if it's actually a blush. But anyways, I use this Contour Intuitive Eye and Face Sculpting Palette. I'm guessing it is a blush. So it's this from NYX as well. And I use this shade over here. So I will go in with a brush like that. And just tap in like a generous amount. Smile. And then for highlighter, actually I use a lot of NYX products. It's gonna be very problematic because NYX has left the country. They've left South Africa, so it's gonna be very problematic. I then use this bronzer as a highlighter. like this because it's very like soft and subtle doesn't leave any harsh lines so i really enjoy that and then i just use it on my nose as well mm, i feel like something's missing maybe i should just add that in my inner corner And then the lip combo that everybody is always asking about. So the lip combo once again is this LA Girl pencil. It's LA Girl pencil in the color chocolate and then the NYX soft matte lip cream and the color Abu Dhabi. I do have three different colors. It's all, it all depends on how I'm feeling. Okay, so you wanna make sure you like put in like a generous amount. Can you please go? <laughs> so, jeez, I'm looking a little pale. You wanna make sure you put a generous amount of lip liner and then you'll take in
that's that and to finish it off once again NYX matte finish uh, setting spray I feel like I have a brown missing You wanna be very generous with your setting spray. Don't be selfish. Hey guys, so I forgot to show you the finished look of the makeup. So I literally just went on and applied lashes and then I just put on the hair and this is how I achieve my everyday look. Like as I mentioned that the highlighter is very um, like nice and I also like the fact that the um, blush has a little bit of shimmer into it so it does just give you like that glow that you need so yeah if you guys enjoyed more of these makeup tutorials maybe i can try incorporate them into more vlogs please do let me know and yeah i can maybe also try different products that you guys use so you guys could suggest like if you want me to try a different foundation or something to see what it actually look like on my skin because i know we do, all don't have access to nars but it is a really good foundation and I love it and I'm super sad that I'm almost running out so I need to make a plan <laughs> on what I'm gonna do but yeah if you guys are also interested in this hair I will be having a video up soon on my channel I'm not sure if it's gonna be up before this vlog is up but if it is I will link it somewhere up here so that you guys can check it out and yeah um, I'm gonna go back to working now <laughs> see you guys later hey guys so it's currently eight o'clock and i've literally been chilling because i have like a huge headache so my sister and i went on a no meat diet for the week and i'm currently feeling so weak and super hungry i just wanted meat so i literally ordered food from the rock at design quarter and they package their food in this so i literally got some ribs because i've been craving ribs whoa literally that's how much ribs i got and the chips in there i am so going to enjoy this wow